welcome to Too Fond of Books. My name is Janelle and this is Murder Mystery Monday. In this series, I recommend one backlist book from my own collection that I've really enjoyed and that I think that you might want to try yourself. And today is a newer one to my um, collection and I am so excited because I just love the cover of this one. And this is A Most Peculiar Malaysian Mystery by Shimini Flint. This is the first in her Inspector Singh series. He is a detective on the Singapore police force, but each book actually takes place in a different country in that area. And in this first book, we head over to Malaysia. And so I just love this series. Um, they're really well written. Um, Inspector Singh is just this fantastic character. I love him as a detective. This first book was published in 2009. The portly methodical Inspector Singh is a thorn in the side of his bosses on the Singapore Police Department. So they send him off to Malaysia to monitor the trial of Chelsea Liu a Singaporean beauty queen accused of killing her abusive millionaire ex-husband. The plot, revolving around the difference between secular and Islamic custody law, is unexpectedly intricate and surprising, but the keenest pleasures of this book center on Inspector Singh and his attempts to see justice served while some, somehow maneuvering around his excessively zealous sergeant, keeping his white sneakers clean and scoring the occasional ta tasty snack. I love that. I also love on the back, it says, who's likely to like this? Fans of the number one ladies detective agency and of Colin Cotterell's series featuring Dr. Siri Pybon. Pye I've not read that series. Um, but yeah, I can see that as as recommendations. This, yeah, this series is, is really great. Uh, and like I always do, I'm going to read to you from the beginning, chapter one. The accused, Chelsea Liu, was in court. She sat on a wooden bench in a wooden box, handcuffed to a policewoman. The prosecutor, a large, shiny Malay man, marking time until his own elevation to the bench, watched the court official read out the charge in a slow, ponderous voice. That you, Chelsea Liu, on or about the 18th day of July, committed murder by causing the death of Alan Lee. The judge said, how does the accused plead, guilty or not guilty? The shriveled old man with large yellow her herbiferous teeth and a thick head of implausibly black hair managed to inject a wealth of disbelief into the possibility of a not guilty plea. Many of the judges in Malaysia were drawn from the civil service, which meant they had previously been public prosecutors themselves. Their instincts were conservative and their sympathies rarely with the accused in criminal trials. So for today's Murder Mystery Monday recommendation, I have a most peculiar Malaysian mystery, oh sorry, a most peculiar Malaysian murder by Shimini Flint. Let me know in the comment section down below if you've heard of this series, if you've read any Shimini Flint. I know she actually also writes quite a lot of children's books. I haven't read any of them. Um, or if this sounds interesting to you. Also, do you enjoy reading books that are set in countries other than your own? That's the one thing that I really love about the series as a whole. And I will see you for another video soon. Bye.